We end tonight with a look at another young innovator. We've been featuring young people trying to change the world. Tonight, Jack Andreka, who started Googling ways to prevent cancer after losing a friend of the disease. And look where it took him. Jack Andreka's science project doesn't sound like a high school sophomore's crowning achievement. It sounds more like a Nobel Prize winner's. I created a new way to detect pancreatic ovarian and lung cancer that costs three cents and takes five minutes to run. Pancreatic. Ovarian. And lung. And lung. But also. Hold on. Costs how much? Three cents. Three cents. And takes how long? Five minutes to run. That's right. After a close friend died from pancreatic cancer, this 16-year-old from Crownsville, Maryland, unleashed his hyperdrive intellect on preventing more cancer deaths. It's 168 times faster, over 26,000 times less expensive, and over 400 times more sensitive than our current methods of diagnosis. He tinkered in his room, and using information readily available online, Andreka came up with a new way to detect cancer. 85% of all pancreatic cancers are diagnosed late, when someone has less than a 2% chance of survival, and our current test costs $800 per test and misses 30% of all pancreatic cancers. Jack, stand up. Andreka's innovative mind got him a shout out at the White House Science Fair. President Obama was impressed by this young innovator's tenacity. Jack requested space from research labs to pursue his work nearly 200 times. 200 times he asked, 200 times he was turned down. Finally, with the help of some folks at John Hopkins, he got the research facilities that he needed. Did it sting when you would get rejections? It definitely did sting, because I kind of knew that a lot of them were just kind of being a bit discriminatory, because they were like, this is a 15-year-old. He can't possibly be doing this. And Dismissive. Yeah, very dismissive. In the category of medicine and health science. Which may explain the overwhelming emotion he felt when he won last year's Intel International Science and Engineering Fair. The sweet validation came with $100,000 in scholarships. But Jack Andreka's got his eye on even bigger things. The name of the competition is called the Tricorder X Prize. It's a $10 million prize. Oh, wait, did you say $10 million? Yes, $10 million. Essentially what you have to do is develop something the size of a smartphone that you scan over your skin and it will diagnose any disease instantly. Jack's fielding a team of other high schoolers to compete against 300 teams of adult scientists and corporations in the XPRIZE competition. He says youth is an advantage that new eyes are more likely to solve old problems.